I find that skepticism is key regarding online information. We must identify a credible news source and use only trusted publishers who authenticate this information. Chào mừng bạn đến với Logic of IELTS. Hôm nay mình sẽ nói về phần speaking. Bạn có nghĩ câu trả lời bạn vừa nghe là một câu trả lời tốt? Hãy cùng xem trong video này. Mình sẽ chỉ cho bạn câu trả lời trên sai ở điểm nào, ok? You may think the answer is alright. It has good vocabulary, it's detailed, grammatical and long. But it's not good to learn from and it may make your learning worse. Have you practiced mock speaking before? Have you ever wondered why you use the wrong words or get stuck after just one sentence? This is why. These are the academic terms our model answer used. These vocabulary terms are very academic and specific, so they only work in specific sentences. You can't just sprinkle them in like salt. That means you are more likely to incorrectly use the word. Further, you are more likely to incorrectly pronounce the word, which might make you say something like uh or get stuck. Just think about it. You might increase your score for lexical resource, but you are risking the other three speaking criteria. You might mispronounce a word, or use it with wrong grammar, or stumble over saying it. Reading teaches reading, and speaking teaches speaking. 50% of speaking is how you pronounce things and how smoothly your ideas flow. Model answers cannot teach this. A model doesn't teach you syllabic stress or sentence level stress, and yes, that's real. A model won't teach you elision, which is how pronunciation changes when words stick together. You can learn from a model answer. You can learn vocabulary, phrases, and maybe grammar, but you won't learn to speak. A model doesn't teach you the real test experience. Think back to the presentations you did in your own language. It was probably quite difficult. You probably memorized it or had written notes. You forgot words, skipped parts, made mistakes. The same thing will happen in English, but the results will be much worse. The reason? We can't learn to speak from reading. We have to practice according to the real test environment. So how do you practice speaking in the real test experience? How do you find answers that work without memorizing written models? And how do you learn things like sentence stress and elision? All of these things have solutions. Look for the next Logic of IELTS lesson video and we will show you all of those solutions.